hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to show you how i cut my hair in layers and also there is a trick to avoid thin end and getting the voluminized effect a lot of you have been asking me about what kind of hair cut i have so i thought of sharing this video so without wasting any more time let's get started to the video first flip your head gathered all your hair and bring it in front comb it nicely make sure you detangle your hair properly spend a good amount of on that if your hair is curly and wavy then you can straight your hair temporarily or just spray some water for accurate measurement my hair is naturally straight so i skip that part once you're happy with your combing then take a rubber band and tie a ponytail right on top of my forehead it's a very old school technique preferred by many YouTubers and personally I feel this step made the whole haircut very easy and manageable. It's been 3 years I am giving this haircut to myself and that's how I maintain my hair. Now make sure the ponytail is on the middle of the forehead. If it's your first time then try to place yourself in front of a mirror and my hair is pretty long so to maintain the grip I am going to give it another tie and I don't have any kind of rough hair issue or split ends I just want to shorten my hair little bit. So here I want to reduce like 6 inches of my hair so now I am going to cut at least 4 inches now. Now take a regular scissor and hold it in 45 degree angle then cut your hair very smoothly never cut your hair horizontally that will make your hair look very blunt now place your scissor vertically upwards and lightly snip your hair in a 45 degree angle to get some texture. Now once you are done remove all your hair band and see how beautifully you get the layer cut in your hair. Now avoid any kind of hair, thin hair. First I am going to middle parting my hair up and back in both sides and again I am going to comb my hair for the smoothing effect. Now I am going to gather all my hair again and going to tie a rubber band at the end. You can see this part of hair is very thin because of the layer. Now again I am going to hold my scissor 45 degree angle and going to cut, cut my hair. This part is totally optional. I like my hair to be voluminized. If you want to keep these layers on your hair then please skip this part. And if you want to cut any kind of bangs then you can try this method for your front hair as well. I personally don't like bangs for real so I'll skip that part. And, and that's it. That's how you can achieve this long layers hairstyle at home without making the end thin. So if you like this video please let me know in the comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe my channel.